Welcome to Manga Experts. We are back with another top 10 recommendation list. If you like our videos, please leave a like and a comment of your favorite suggestions below. Without any further ado, let's get started. Number 10, Escape Room. Sean's unfeeling personality consistently drives people away from him. He is overly rational and sociopathic. That is, until he wakes up after a night of heavy drinking in an escape room. Now he must use his unique mind and join hands with other players to survive sadistic games of life and death. The only way out is to escape. The plot of this webtoon is a little bit generic just like we usually see in these type of movies. But the amount of detail and the thought process behind each room is so intricate that it's so compelling and draws you in. The art is not exactly the best but the story makes up for it. Number 9. Crime Puzzle A criminal psychologist is linked to a murder of a government official. A criminal profiler will conduct 10 interviews with the criminal psychologist to find the truth behind the serial murders. He has to put together the pieces of the crime and one massive scene will reveal itself. The art looks a bit too much outdated but the story makes up for the flaws in the art. You will like it if you are into psychological manoirs. Number 8. Pills for the Skills In his whole life, he had never been outstanding in any way, whether it be studying, games, or sports. He excelled at nothing. A stray neighborhood cat was his only friend. One day, he decided to disappear for good. When he was about to die, the black cat he used to feed came up to him and offered him some pills. These pills can give him certain skills after consuming them. From that day onwards, his life changed for good, or that was what he thought. This is a very short but good read. Number 7. Ordinary Child Yeon Hee, a righteous police officer, struggled as a working mother and raised her son Do Yeon alone. Do Yeon, who is 20 years old, grew up to be a normal child with a good heart like her mother's wish. But the dark shadows of serial killings begin to fall on the lives of two happy people. This manhwa revolves around a few characters and every single one of them have a certain level of depth to them. The mystery factor in this manhwa is very good. It keeps the reader hooked to the story. The art is also pretty good and the overall pacing is also on point. Number 6. Justified Murder Dr. Saw Wu Han is targeted for revenge and ends up killing her attacker in self-defense. Her detective husband helps her dump the body and frame it as the work of a serial killer. The only problem is that the real serial killer knows what they did and is blackmailing them into committing more murders. This one is a solid thriller manhwa. There are few but well-made characters. The story is short but well-paced. You can finish it in one sitting. Number 5. Manhunt the story began on a certain night in H Country's damn village, where a floating corpse was discovered. After the villagers reported to the police, Old Zhang and Zhang Kai went forth to handle the case. There was a pair of handcuffs found on the corpse. Furthermore, the method of killing the victim was extremely vile. Nie Yun ordered Old Zhang and Zhang Kai to solve the case within seven days. However, during the process, two civil policemen died on the job, implicating the only person who had the clues. When he was found, he was already dead for seven days. Number 4. Fake Humans Having escaped her abusive mother, 20-year-old Ji Ah lives a modest life with her little sister, Su. When Su does not return from her field trip under some sinister circumstances, Ji Ah vows to do anything she can to get her sister back. As she and her high school friend Won Sung delve further into the mystery, they find that there might be a larger conspiracy under the surface. A tangled web that includes a cult, a mystery, and powerful figures that might shake South Korea to its core. The mystery factor in this webtoon is very good. You don't know what's going on and there is an aura of mystery around every single character and there are some characters which act way more human-like. Give this a try if you want a really good mystery thriller webtoon. Number 3. Red Cage In the worst neighborhoods, the back of a taxi is called The Cage. 5326 is the code. If you are bullied or someone did you wrong in any way, you can hire a taxi driver for a price who will solve these problems for you. Call and Deke will be there, waiting for you. The Rainbow Taxi offers the full spectrum of special services. This story follows the Rainbow Taxi Company as they take clients to do revenge acts for money. This is a very, very disturbing but very well-made story. It's more like Vigilante but on crack. Each case the MC takes is very unique and there is always a very satisfying ending for each case. Only read it if you can handle a really, really dark thriller. Number 2. Confessions Miss Jang is moving on from teaching after her daughter was found dead in the school pool. 
Her death was deemed a tragic accident, but Miss Jang suspects otherwise. And before she resigns, she's about to reveal a shocking truth. The story of this webtoon is outstandingly amazing. It is adapted from a Japanese novel and made into a Korean webtoon. This manhwa is one of my favorite thriller manhwas. The story has a lot of depth to it and there are twists and turns that I have never seen before in any thriller comic. Number 1. Devil's Editing Main character is a super simp for an online streamer. One day, she decides that she's gonna make videos in real haunted places and the main character applies as an editor and gets accepted. When he arrives at the location, shit hits the fan and he witnesses one of the crew members murdering someone. This is a good suspense thriller ex-horror manhwa. The art is also very good and goes well with the haunted theme of the story. And it's made by artists of bastards, so you can expect a good story from it. 